Hey and welcome to our Kivi tutorial where we talk about formatting. In part two today we talk about labels and how you can align text in a label. That's actually not as easy as you would think. Check it out. Hey, as, as part of our tutorial where we talked about formatting in Kivi, so colors and sizes for labels and buttons, etc., we also touched on how to align text within a label. So this is a little app I built for that purpose, which um, shows the properties of this gray label. So the gray rounded box, that is my label. I have some text in there and of this label, I'm showing the property size, font size, text size, and texture size. Now for this particular video, what's going to matter is the text size. Now, I think it's worth having a short video that deals with this topic separately because the Kivi documentation at the moment, in my opinion, isn't entirely clear when it comes to um, aligning text in a label. The instructions you will find on the internet are to use H align and V align. So if I want to align this text to the right here and in, in the middle, then that's correct, that's what you need to do, except that alignment does not work in relation to the edge of your label. It works in relation to the edge of your text bounding box. Now this is a box you cannot see, but it is a box that is defined by text size. So if you want to align your text to your label, the first thing you have to do is set the text size to be the size of the label then you can align your text to your bounding box, which is the same size as your label, and therefore effectively you're aligning to the edge of the label. Now, because if I run the code as it is, you see that my text actually isn't aligned at all. So let me just prove that to you. If I run it, you see my text isn't aligned. So what I need to do is I need to set the text size equal to the size of the label. So size is the size of the label. I'm, I'm in label here. So self refers to label. So this is the label size. I set my text bounding box to be the size of the label. And then I align within that text bounding box. So if I run this now, you will see that my text is now centered vertically and right aligned horizontally. There you go. Hope you found that useful. Thanks. Bye.